guys welcome back to my channel oh was doing well and staying safe and had an and, and had an amazing weekend or still having an amazing weekend um anyway guys so i was gonna make this the other day but uh never did but i made this for my old channel before i deleted it guys and i wanted to make it for this channel as well now most of you know i'm a huge movie uh, music collector i love it um so a lot of you know that garth brooks is my favorite singer of all time um i just absolutely love him I mean, I grew up listening to him. I started listening to him when I was about six or seven, and I've been listening to him ever since. So I was like, you know what? I got to, you know, make this video for you guys and show you all my Garth Brooks collection. Now, of course, I don't have everything out there. I want to get everything he has put out, um, but some of those sets are really expensive. Um, but maybe, I, maybe one day I might try to, you know, get one off Amazon or eBay or something like that, but, uh, I have a lot of stuff to show you. I'm so excited. I have a lot of, uh, box sets, have some other stuff, a lot of CDs. Uh, I have every single studio album that he's put out, uh, which is pretty amazing. And, uh, um, all his Christmas stuff as well. So, got a huge stack of those and got some other things to show you guys, okay? So, let's go ahead and do my, um, uh, do one particular thing. I got this for Christmas, um, Last year, yeah, last year, and, uh, absolute, no, year for that, I'm sorry guys, year for that, and I absolutely love it so much, came out at the right time, right around Christmas time, I'm like, okay, I gotta get this for Christmas, um, cause I haven't seen them since, so I'm like, okay, I'm so glad I got it now, and, um, and that is the limited edition, um, Garth Brooks, the Legacy Collection, guys, so this is, um, seven vinyl LPs and seven CDs, guys, so, um, I'm absolutely in love with this, I'm so happy I picked it up. Um, got for Christmas. It's, like I said, it's a numbered uh, edition. Um, but these are the CDs you get out in there, guys. But I uh, absolutely love it. Like I said, um, I did a video on this, guys. If I can find it, I'll link it down below. But um, you get all these records in here. You get a poster. It says, um, including No Fences, which is one of my favorites. Um, the Chase in Pieces, Fresh Horses, and Triple Live, the three album sets. So in 180 gram vinyl, I'll let you read it. I'm not sure. I can just let you see it, guys. But uh, this is what you get in there. Oh, love it so much, guys. But uh, oh, if only, if only I had a record player. But I already have all these CDs anyway. So um, I'm just so happy to have this in my collection. But yeah, if you're a Garth Brooks, you know, fanatic like me, this has to be in your collection. It is a must-have. So I love the hologram look to it. And the back is awesome as well. Um, but yeah, like it's on the side here as well. And these are all numbered, guys. So... Um, yeah, amazing. This is number, here's a number on the back, on the bottom here, guys. But, uh, yeah, so happy to have it in my collection. There's that. Oh my god, that's heavy. Okay, so next one up, I've had this for a long time. Uh, I got it from Walmart years and years ago. It was like in the dump bin for five dollars. And I'm like, oh my god, I got to get that. <laughs> I'm so happy I do, because it's really hard to find now, guys. But, uh, anyway, so that's the Garth Brooks, the Entertainer set. Um, little DVD set here. Um, I love it. It's like a tin set. A little tin case, but here's the back. Of course, Mr. Garth there. But, you know, here's the inside. They're all, like, his tours and stuff. It just folds out. They're all indiv individual DVDs, but it says the Entertainer on it. But, yeah. Um, I have these, um, DVDs in the case somewhere, so they're not in here. But, just had to show you that as well absolutely love it so glad i picked it up when i did but yeah i've already watched every single um concert in here amazing especially um crap i'm drawing a blank when he did in new york such a part good lord yes absolutely love that concert amazing all right so that's next up i've had this for a long time very first box that i got they got this from walmart.com years and years ago and i'm so happy i picked it up and that is a limited series guys Yes, here's the CDs you get in here. The Double Live. Absolutely love this set, guys. So there's the limited series. There's a couple other ones that he's got out that I don't have. There's a, I think there's like two more I don't have any to get. So there's that one. I love that set so much. All right, this one is really neat. Now, these are really cool. These are like covers of other songs that, you know, from other influencers. Five decades of influences. Eight this says, Blame it all my, Blame it all on my roots. Oh, I love this set so much, but, uh, yeah, here's the back. This is, um, when he was live at the wind, which is really, really cool. Um, there's actually a DVD out, 
Um, the documentary did last year on A&E. Um, I need to get that DVD. I need to get it. So next time I'm ever, if I'm ever at Walmart, I find it, I'm going to pick it up. So, um, I need to get it. So it's a documentary. It's called, what's it called? It's called Garth Brooks. It's like a biopic or like behind the scenes interviews with him. I love, love watching that kind of stuff. So there's that. This one came out a couple years ago. This is a Target exclusive, which is so cool. Um, but, uh, uh, well, the, the CD in here has two extra songs. That's why it's a Target exclusive. But I think you get this at Walmart as well. But anyway, and that's the Garth Brooks, the Ultimate Collection. This one right here. Uh, has his new album, Gunslinger, in here. But, uh, or his newest one. <laughs> but, uh, because you know the new one's this one. His new album is called Fun. So, um, that's what you get in there, guys. Um, when I saw this one, oh my god, I could not wait to pick it up. So, here's the back. If you have not heard Garth Brooks sing, oh my gosh, you're missing out. He is phenomenal. So, yeah, I just had to get that one for the collection as well. Maybe one day he'll do another one of these box sets. I'm hoping he does. So, um, you know, with his new album in it. But, yeah, I love the colors of this one. So, here's that one. All right, guys, let's go and do the two other things. I'll get to my CDs, all right? So, these came out. I'm, I think he said he's going to do five um, books. I'm like, oh. Hope so. So these are the first two. And I don't know why he skipped three. But uh, anyway. So here's the first one, guys. This is the first five years right here. Of the anthology. Um, it's written and recorded by Garth Brooks. Um, amazing, guys. This is, yeah, the anthology part one. So there's the front. This is one of those slipcases. Well, I'll show you in a minute, guys. When I saw this was coming out, I had to grab my, get my hands on this one. Like I said, it comes out just like this. Like a little hard case. Slip case there. But here's the front. I love the front. Oh, my Love this one from, you know, North Vincent's, but, um, no. Good Lord, I'm drawing a blank here. What's the name of that CD? Wow. I can't even think of the name of that one, guys. It is North Vincent's, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know what I'm thinking about, but, um, but anyway, guys, here's the back. This is written by Trisha Wood, that's really cool. Oh, love this one. And of course, you get um, five CDs in here as well. That's really cool. Um, but anyway, so there's what this looks like, guys. Awesome. I love it so much. Okay, there's part one. Okay, so instead of going to part two, he went to part three. So really cool. This one didn't come with a slipcase, which I'm not sure why. It's the box, which I'm not sure why. But um, anyway. So this is the anthology part three. This is the live version. I had this one um, for Christmas a couple years ago. There's the back again. Written by Trisha again. I love this picture right here, guys. I absolutely love that. So, um, of course, you get CDs in here as well. Um, just like the album flips out from the front here. You get the CDs in there. But uh, so happy to have this in my collection. I cannot wait for the other parts to come out soon. Um, he hasn't, you know, released another date for the, whatever part is going to be next, I'm not sure. So, since he skipped away, skipped over part two. So, part two probably might be next, but, uh, this is what you get in there, guys. But, uh, yeah. So happy to have that in my collection. Alright, let's go move to my CDs. That's the last thing I gotta do, guys. So, these are all the CDs right here. Oh my gosh. And there's a few other ones that I need to get. Um, there's a few other, like, double lives I need to get. Um, so to get his newest double live, I don't have that one just yet. I need to get that one, but that'd be probably the next CD I do pick up. But you can still get it. You get it at Walmart, Target, Best Buy, I guess dot com. But um, no, Best Buy doesn't sell CDs anymore. It sucks. Okay, so let's go in one by one, no particular order on these. Um, let's go ahead and get started, guys. Okay, first one up is um, Garth and uh, Trisha Yearwood Christmas together. This is the uh, their first Garth and Trisha duet album. When I saw this coming out, I had to pick it up. Of course. Duh. That wasn't an option, right? So, there's that one. I love the cover of that one. Alright, this is his newest one. Now, when this one came out, I had no idea there was a limited edition version until someone had told me. Like, I had no idea there was a limited edition one. So, I went on one, got the original one first, and then found... My dad had ordered me the limited edition one off Amazon, which I had no idea you can buy the limited edition at Walmart and Target and places like that. So, I could have just bought it at Walmart, right? But I didn't. So, anyway. So, like I said, um, his new one, Fun, here. And this is just a regular version. And this one is a limited edition. You see the hologram? Um... This one's not hologram. This one, you see it. 
mixed different colors, but uh, they're all the same songs. It's just, it's just, I guess, a different cover. So, I mean, even it has limited edition on it. So, I'm not going to open this one that I'm due to because I have this one open. But i um, so glad to add these in the collection, of course. So, here's fun. All right. This one is very first one. I need to get another case for this one because this one um, is messed up, which sucks. But, very first album, guys. Oh, young he was. So cute. Still is. So. All right. There's that one. All right, then I got his one of the Christmas albums, Beyond the Season. Love the color of the, or the cover of this one. Yeah, so there's that. All right, then one of my favorites he has done. I love this CD so much, and that is the Chase guys. I love the colors of this one. What's that? All right, then we got. I was right. Okay, then we got Rope in the Wind. If not in my top three favorite albums of all time. Garth Brooks, Al Garth Brooks albums of all time. I absolutely love this one so much. Such a, so many good songs on here, guys. Yes. So there's Rope in the Wind. Alright, then I'm going to need to get another case for this one. This one's messed up as well. That has no fences. I love the colors. Just like the book over there. It's pretty amazing. Yeah, so there's no fences. Or this one, um, I think this was a McDonald's exclusive. I'm not exactly sure, but I got it off Amazon. And that is just a collection. Uh, I think this was an exclusive to McDonald's or something, but, um, which I didn't get from McDonald's, like I said, I got from Amazon. So, uh, just like different songs and different albums, but, uh, had to get it for the collection. Alright, this one, I love this one as well. This is the limited black edition. That's, uh, Man Against the Machine. I didn't even know that was even on there. Wow. There's something new when you look at something all the way, right? <laughs> Love this one as well. Yep, there's Manny Gets Machine and uh, Love This One as well. And of course, that's Gunslinger. I love the cover of this one. Alright. We got a double live here. They're all the same songs, but they're just different covers. So, I'm I'm taking it. They're like from different tours because this one, what it's like, what it looks like. So, um, but yeah, there's one double live here. And they're all two disc sets, by the way. All right, then one of my favorites as well, Fresh Horses. Yes. All right, this one I think was an exclusive to the limited time only, but I found this one at FYE years ago, and that is the hits, guys. It says, says limited time only, but so glad to find this one there. I was like, oh my god, I could not believe I found it there. I, I like, snagged it up just like that. Yep. Yeah. Okay. This is my top three. If not my second favorite Carp Brooks film, or album of all time. And that is Pieces. In Pieces. I absolutely love this one. I love the album cover. Love the back. Here's like a crossword puzzle. But, uh, not a bad song here anywhere, guys. Alright, I got some more Double Lives. I got this one right here. This cover. Here, it's the back. And I got this one right here. Okay. Then we got um, another good one that is Scarecrow. Love the cover. That. All right, another good one as well. And he hasn't. He doesn't have a bad album, in my opinion. Okay. Then we got Sevens. A lot of good songs on this one. Okay. We have a few more to go, guys, and we're done, all right? This one is a little, um, when he played Chris Gaines in the movie. Um, yeah, the pre-soundtrack to the movie, The Lamb. Okay. But, uh, since Garth Brooks and The Life of Chris Gaines, I think this is such an underrated album, guys. I love it so much. And like I said, it's in The Life of Chris Gaines. When I heard, um, uh, Lost on You on YouTube, I saw the video, I'm like, I fell in love with this CD, so... Had to find it. I'm so happy I found it at, um, I found this at, um, uh, Second and Charles a couple years ago. I'm like, oh my gosh. So excited to have, to find this here. Oh my God. Crazy. I'm so, I was like, oh my God. I was so happy. Okay, we got five more to go, guys. We'll be done, all right? This one, I've listened to the CD so many times. I've had it for a long time. I love it so much. It's got two CDs and a DVD, but, um, that is the Ultimate Hits. This is, um, yeah, three to set, of course. Like I said, two CDs and one DVD. But, uh, here's the songs you get over here. And this is the uh, music videos and stuff. 
What's that? Yeah, there's the hits. Alright guys, next one up is The Lost Sessions. I mean, look how young he was. So cute there. Alright, another little double live. I got this one right here. This one looks like it's from um, Central Park. Yeah. Yeah, of course. You can see all those people down there. Down there. I think if I am if I got this right, I believe I am. But this is a free concert he did. If only I lived in New York back in the 90s, right? But, um, oh my god, I would love to have gone to that. So, Alright, two more to go, guys. I got another double live. This one's really cool looking. Alright guys, so the final one is his other Christmas album. This is a from 1999, of course. Um, this is the first edition, um, Garth Brooks and the Magic of Christmas. I think I found this at Second and Charles a couple years ago as well. Like, I was looking at the CDs and I found them, like, oh my god. So, of course I picked it up. That wasn't even an option, right? But, um, anyways, those are all, that's everything I own from Garth Brooks. And like I said, I hope to get more real soon. Um, try to complete the collection if I can. So, anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. So, make sure to like this video, guys. Comment down below. And then let me know if you're a Garth Brooks fan like I am. I'm a mega fan. I love him so much. Um, but, like I said, guys, I'm just trying to get everything that he has out there. But, um, but anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. Like I said, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Share this video around, guys. And I guess I will talk to you next time. Bye.